Hello, everyone. I'm Dr. Wen. Here I ask the question, how many zeros terminate 100 factorial? By definition, 100 factorial equals 1 times 2 times 3 times times until times 99 times 100. This question is equivalent to find how many 10 as a factor of 100 factorial. Why? Because each 10 contributes one zero at the end of 100 factorial. Since 10 equals two times five, we are only interested in finding how many two as a factor of 100 factorial and how many five as a factor of 100 factorial. Considering the prime number factorization of 100 factorial, we have 100 factorial equals two to the power of P1 times three to the power of P2 times five to the power of P3 and so on. We are only interested in factors two and five. From one to 100, there are 50 even numbers. Therefore, the power P1 is bigger than or equal to 50. From 1 to 100, there are 20 integers or multiples of 5. There are 5, 10, 15, 20, and so on, until 95 and 100. Totally, we have 20 integers here. Four of these are also multiples of five squared, which is 25. Why should we pay more attention to these four numbers? Because each contains five twice as a factor. For example, 25 equals five times five. 50 equals five times five times two. The factor of five appears totally equals 20 plus four, which is 24. Why? Here we have 20. Here we have four extra totally should be 24. Therefore, T3 equals 24. Since P1 is bigger than 50, and P1 is bigger than P3, one factor of two and one factor of five make one ten. Therefore, 100 factorial is divisible by 10 as many times as factor five appears. Why? Totally, we only have 24 factors of 5. We only need 24 factors of 2. Here, we have more than 24 of factor 2. Therefore, there are 24 zeros at the end of 100 factorial. That's all. 
Thanks for watching and see you next time.